Hey guys, it's Mr. Chu, and here's what you're going to learn today. By the end of this video, you should be able to solve quadratic equations using multiple methods. And for this example, we'll be solving by factoring. We're asked to determine possible solutions to the following equation. We have 0 equals n squared plus 9n minus 36. First, we'll list out our ABC values. And to begin our factoring method, we'll start by multiplying A and C together. So that's 1 times negative 36 to give us negative 36. Now we want to look for two numbers that multiply to negative 36 that add up to our b value, which is 9. So we have negative 1 and 36. We'll take negative 2 and 18, negative 3 and 12, negative 4 and 9, negative 6 and positive 6. Now we want to figure out which of these pairs adds up to our b value, which is 9. And that is actually going to be negative 3 and 12. So what we can do is rewrite our equation as 0 equals n squared minus 3n plus 12n minus 36. Now notice, we can start by factor by grouping. So we'll have 0 equals n times n minus 3, because both n squared and negative 3n had an n in common. And 12 and negative 36, they're both divisible by 12. So we can factor out a 12. We'll have n minus 3 as what's left over. And you'll notice that we have n minus 3 as a factor for both terms. So when we factor, we'll have n minus 3 and n plus 12 as our other factor. Now using the zero product property, we'll take n minus 3 and set it equal to 0, and n plus 12 set equal to 0. We have our two answers as n equals 3 and n equals negative 12. And that's it.